Emily Blunt claims that since she is not Pam, co-workers yell out when they see her with husband John Krasinski. Even though the office ended more than 10 years ago, Jim and Pam remain a source of affection for viewers of the NBC sitcom. Emily Blunt, the wife of Krasinski, said on the most recent episode of Variety's Awards Circuit podcast that fans aren't always pleased to see her out with her 13-year spouse. Do you know how many people still yell out, I wish you were with Pam, like when I'm walking next to him? Blunt, 40, disclosed. Where is Pam? She's not here, I think to myself. She said, she's the best, when asked whether she had met Fisher. She is among our closest pals. We adore Jenna. Fisher, 49, said back in 2020 that it's difficult to convey to fans that she and Krasinski, 44, are just former co-workers who fell in love on the set of an oral history of The Office. People don't realize that John and I are not a couple in real life, Fisher said at the time to host in Kevin Malone's on-screen partner Brian Baumgartner. They don't understand it. Jim and Pam flirted, dated, broke up, got back together, got married, had two kids, and eventually relocated from Scranton to Austin, Texas, during the course of the nine seasons of The Office. I don't know how to explain it, because it's a little bit like telling kids there's no Santa, she said. According to Fisher, she feels obligated to justify her relationship with Krasinski by saying that they aren't actually in love. While Fisher married writer and filmmaker Lee Kirk the same year, Krasinski has been married to Blunt since 2010. James Gunn was her former spouse from 2000 until 2008. On Watch What Happens Live with Andy Cohen, the actress spoke about her on-screen connection with Krasinski in the past. She said, Oh, I have real chemistry with John. There's like a real part of me that is Pam and a real part of him that's Jim, and those parts of us were genuinely in love with one another.